Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media back with another Dokkan Battle video and today we are going to be showcasing the newly Extreme Z Awakened AGL Super Saiyan Blue Goku on the global side of the game and honestly, aside from the Fizz Vegito Blue EZA which we still don't have a release date for, this guy was definitely my most highly anticipated Extreme Z Awakening on global and for those of you that haven't tested him out yet, haven't used him at any events, and just haven't had a chance to see how amazing he is, you'll understand why I say that in just a second. Alright, so first things first, I want to talk about his details, so for anybody that already knows exactly what he does, then feel free to skip ahead maybe a minute, minute and a half, and we'll get into the gameplay. So starting with his stats, 17,626 attack, at rainbow status. It's not the highest we've seen from a Dokkan Fest EZA unit, but also not low. I would say it's still very respectable and it does help a lot in his damage output. He also has 11,503 defense, which is quite high, and 16,700 or 272 HP. Moving on to his leader skill, he gives AGL types key plus 3, HP, attack, and defense plus 120%, and his super attack greatly raises attack and causes immense damage while sacrificing 5% HP. So he does stack attack every single time he supers, which means that the longer the event is, the more damage he'll do. And his passive is attack and defense plus 59% plus an additional attack and defense plus 59% for 10 turns from the start of turn plus an additional attack plus 59% and performs a critical hit starting from the ninth turn from the start of battle once only. And his links are Super Saiyan, Warrior Gods, Kamehameha, Prepare for Battle, Over in a Flash, Shocking Speed, and Fierce Battle. And his categories are Realm of Gods, Pure Saiyans, Full Power, Representatives of Universe 7, Goku's Family, Kamehameha, and Bond of Master and Disciple. So those are all the details you need to know about this guy and without further ado, Let's jump into the gameplay and uh, see what he's all about. So, as you can see, on this first slot, or first rotation, we actually don't have the EZA Goku, but the reason I kept this run is because on the second rotation, we actually have like the perfect setup with both the STR Super Saiyan Blue Kalkin Goku and the EZA Goku and also Bula on support for rotation, or rotation for support, right? So I decided to just keep things as they are. I mean, this shouldn't take too long either way. And we'll move on to the next round. And, uh, you know, we'll probably see some pretty nice damage just right off the bat because we have the support. We have the two guys linked together. It still blows my mind how much freaking damage the LR Goku and Frieza do, man. I mean, it's just, it's crazy. They've been out for over a year now and they're still putting out numbers like this. It's, it's wild. I don't know what they were thinking when they made this unit and I mean, don't don't use that as a reference obviously for what this guy can do because Goku and Frieza are just like on another level. So this guy will still be very impressive but his numbers are not going to be as high as the Go Frieza, all right? So here we go with the first rotation. Um, so starting with a check of the defensive stat, 100 defensive stat, defense, 113,800 and 46 not bad at all of course we do have support of 40 percent from the bula but uh still without the support he should be around 100,000, which is not bad at all and i mean i guess it doesn't really matter too much where we put him uh since neither of them actually link with the bula so why don't we just kick things off with uh the STR Super Saiyan Blue Kauken in the first slot since I want him to take some hits and then he'll attack second and Bula will super two. Let's see what happens. I'm expecting in the range of like 2.5, maybe even 3 million and this super is going to hurt. Yeah, okay, 181k. Damn, dude. Okay, so the STR Super Saiyan Blue Kauken Goku, who we're not showcasing here, is getting 2.8 million already. And the AGL Super Saiyan Blue Kaken Goku is at 2.9 million. Is he going to additional? No additionals, but almost 3 million attack right off the bat. First rotation. Holy crap, guys. Damn. Okay. Uh, <laughs> as I said, uh, he does build attack over time. So what we're seeing right now is literally just the tip of the iceberg. It only goes up from here which is pretty insane considering his first turn damage output is comparable to like 
the maximum damage output of a lot of units out there, right? And uh, <laughs> he's just crazy. He's a crazy, crazy unit. The damage you'll see in this video doesn't really even make sense. Um, I mean, this team overall is just crazy. Like, just look at look at the uh, Go Frieza without the extra boost on his passive, still doing over three million. It's it's, it's kind of wild. All right, so now on this ro this rotation, we have. Oh, we actually can pop the active skill already? You know what, I'm gonna save that one. I'm gonna save the active skill for the Super Saiyan Blue Kalkin because I wanna get the AGL Goku to build up a few more. But what I'll do actually, or like, you know, build up a few more supers, right? So what I'm actually gonna do is pop an Icarus just in case because I'm not really, I mean, I'm not concerned about the Gokus, but the Supreme Cat of Time doesn't have much defense, so we are gonna make sure we don't die here. Uh, let's save that active skill, like I said. We're just gonna keep supering with both these guys, build up the attack, and as I said in previous videos, like, this rotation is quite insane. This is a really, really crazy rotation. Okay, so about 2 million right now from the STR Super Saiyan Blue Kalkin Goku. Doing good damage though, that crit 1.5 mil, and 3.2 now. 3.2 now from the AGL Super Saiyan Blue Kyle. Again, 2.4 mil crit. No additional yet still, unfortunately. Obviously, if you can, you want to get those double supers for twice the attack stack. Stacking, right? In that rotation on that turn. But it's okay. We're still building it just steadily. Uh, 64k, the, <laughs> the item was definitely a good idea. And I think we'll be able to finish it off here with... Uh, the 17 and also the Go Frieza. Uh, should I pop an item just to be safe? I mean, yeah, you know what? Let's go for a Princess Snake. Just be extra, extra safe because I don't really care about completing this run. All I care about is getting as many turns as possible out of the um, Easy A Goku so we can see like some crazy numbers, see just what his potential really is. Um, after the 10th turn, there's not really much else to say. I mean, actually, no, that's not true because he's still going to continue stacking attack with every super. So yeah, in theory, he's going to just keep building attack, keep getting stronger. And the longer the event is, the better it is. But I think after like the first maybe, you know, four or five um, rounds, you'll pretty much have seen most of what you need to see. So yeah, we're going to probably cut this video off around like 15, 20 minutes. And uh, yeah, let's just keep seeing these crazy numbers. Now, this rotation, this turn, we don't have any... Uh, support so the number is going to be a little bit lower than last time but it should still be like over two maybe 2.5 mil still um, and this guy's getting crits all over the place that's awesome okay so 2.8 mil with no supports 2.8 mil with no supports and of course we are, we're still looking for that rotation where I can pop the active skill from the STR Super Saiyan Blue Kalkin and also still have the 40% rotate. Um, man, why, why do I keep mixing up the words rotation and support? I don't know what's going on in my mind right now. But uh, of course the support from either Bula or Supreme Cap Time, that's gonna be an absolutely ridiculous rotation. So I'm excited for that. We gotta get that off for sure before we leave. Uh, one thing that concerns me honestly is that the active skill for the Super Saiyan Blue Kai and Goku does so much damage that we might just one hit KO the enemy so we'll probably have to save it for our you know earliest Super Saiyan God Goku maybe Super Saiyan Blue we'll see how things go though and of course we have to lose some HP first we have to be below 59% I believe okay here we go we are now on Super Saiyan God Goku um, let's see yeah attack is quite high already and should I pop something like a Princess Snake or let's actually just pop a Whis or no, uh, Icarus? Um, because, like, as much as you know, it's good to show a unit's tanking ability, that's not really the focus here. And I'll tell you guys right now, like, he's, he's an okay tank, but he's not like an amazing tank. So, even in the later stages, he's still gonna be taking a whole lot of damage. So, I wouldn't rely on him to be a good tank by any means. Uh, almost 3 million from the STR Super Saiyan Blue Kalkin now. He he has a uh, one dupe, by the way. All right, one dupe, not rainbowed, not even close. So uh, quite impressive damage from him. All right, 82K, that's actually pretty good. 3.6 mil now. 
3.6 mil now from the AGL and we got the additional finally 3.8 mil so over 7 million worth of attack right there right 3.7 or is it 3.6 plus 3.8 so that's uh 7 point uh five right no 7.4 my bad 7.4 million attack total combined right there we're gonna pop another princess snake and let's um I th we're actually probably gonna finish this off yeah uh, with the double go frieza it, this guy's probably not living until like to see the next rotation so um we're gonna move on to super saiyan blue kaioken or no super saiyan blue goku is the enemy uh, we are using Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken. My mind is all over the place right now, man. I think I'm... I don't know what's going on. I mean, yesterday was my birthday, if you guys didn't know. And uh, I was up pretty late, so that might explain my current state of mind. But we're going to try to get through this. We're going to try to get through this. By the way, thank you to everybody that was in the birthday stream yesterday. It was a lot of fun. You guys definitely uh, made my birthday, which was already going really well before the stream, even more enjoyable. So I appreciate you. I appreciate you guys for that. You guys are awesome. And, uh, also thank you for all the birthday wishes. Um, I know there were a lot coming in. I couldn't respond to all of them, but if you guys said happy birthday, then just assume that I read it. Cause I pretty much read all of them. It's just like, it's really hard to reply to so many messages individually, right? So don't take it personally. But uh, your messages were all received, and I do really appreciate you guys. Okay, here we go. Um, I'm not going to pop anything here, but I'm actually kind of scared that the SDR Goku will just straight up kill him. So let's go for the AGL Goku here. Obviously still... Actually, 135,000 defense now. I think we got the extra defense from the uh, Supreme Kai of Time. She gives a little bit more when her like full passive procs. So 135,000 defense. Uh, we actually can get a Dokkan attack, I believe. So let's give her this one. There you go, Dokkan attack. Let's focus, get all these orbs, or these nodes here. Get the perfect attack going. One, two, three, four, five, six, perfect. Okay, we got everything. And the attack goes up to 4.9 mil. Dude. <laughs> Dude. 4.9 mil, almost 5 million attack here. And he's critting for 6.9 mil. Okay, I see you. I see you. All right. That's crazy. That that is that is madness. All right. So I mean, I don't think we'll die honestly if we leave the Android 17 here. Um I don't think he'll die, and I do actually want to lose some HP because I want to be able to use the active skill. So, we're going to risk it a little- oh! No, 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 don't, no, don't do me like this. Don't do me like this. Come on, yo, don't, don't let me die here, that would be so depressing. <sighs> survive, survive, just, just stay alive. Just stay alive. Uh, we're gonna really need Bula to dodge the uh, attack at the end there, and we still have a chance. Yeah, because we're not gonna get supered again. So we just need Bula to dodge, and then we'll be good. Damn, okay. Oh, oh, we're still alive. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap, man. That is terrifying. Okay, so I'm gonna use the Ghost Usher here. Alright, we're gonna skip these attacks. And uh, still wait a minute, right? Still wait a minute to pop the active skill. Because I want to have the support on rotation too. So at the very least, we're, 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 still, we're still safe for this turn. Right? Because there's no attacks coming. 2.6 mil... Wait a second. 2.6 mil. Oh. Oh, I think we actually lost the... Um, the extra 59% on his passive, because I think we passed the 10th turn. I think we passed the 10th turn. Hold on, hold on. Okay, we're still going to do this, though. We're still going to do this. Um, we can't... We can't use back-to-back -back ghost, I should Okay, so instead, we're going to use King Yemma twice. So that we basically have like maximum damage reduction 
And yeah, we'll get through this turn here. All right, we might, I think, actually, we're probably gonna kill the uh, AGL Goku here. So then we'll go over to the STR UI Goku, and then we'll pop the active skill, and uh, you know, see what happens, see what happens. I think though we, we passed turn 10, because I think turn 10 was actually the turn where we uh, used the token attack, I think. This is going to be the last turn of the fight, my friends. Uh, just to check one more time what his stats are looking like. Yeah, 716k attack and 83,000 defense. Um, we did lose, yeah, we did pass turn 10, so yeah, we lost the additional attack and defense, I believe. So, things should still be good, but they could have been better. They could have been better. So, Ghost Usher here. Skip those attacks. And then we are going to let the Goku use his active skill, which still is one of the best animations in my opinion in the entire game. Uh, it, it just it looks really, really good. This is a really, really dope animation. All right. Okay, 3.8 million. Not too shabby. And yeah, we're, we're still looking at a pretty decent attack stat right here. So let's see what the EZA Goku can do with the Bula rotation, but Bula support with the Spirit Bomb support, 4.4 million. Okay. And no crit. We got the additional, though. Additional normal attack of over 2 million. 5 million from <laughs> the STR Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken Goku. And damn, dude. All right, so this is where we die. This is where you die, but uh, I'm happy to call this showcase right here because I think we've seen enough. I think we've seen plenty. Um, <laughs> he's ridiculous. There, there was a reason why I wanted him so bad on Global, and uh, I hope you guys understand now. I'm sure you guys do after seeing those numbers. AGL Super Saiyan Blue should really be Kyle Ken, but I'm glad he's not because we can run him on the same turn or on the same team as the STR Super Saiyan Blue Kaken Goku. So AGL Super Saiyan Blue Goku Extreme Z Awakening Showcase in the books. That is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know in the comments down below what you think about him. Um, damage output wise, I mean, he's got you covered, right? Like if you want damage, this guy will give you damage. All right, like up to almost 5 million attack in this video. We, we could have gotten that even higher if we timed the Spirit Bomb and the supports uh, you know, like timed it properly, which I didn't, but still close to 5 million, almost a 7 million crits on the legendary Goku event. I'm satisfied. I think that's quite enough. All right, so that's going to do it for today's video. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch it. As always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.